Hello everyone, it is time for us to see what I have planned for the month of August as far as the decks go. Um, for the month of July, I used Superlinarius, uh, and if you're not familiar with those cards, I can show you a couple of those. But I used the Superlinarius. This is a Spark Edition that's on linen. And I like this deck a lot. But we used Superlinarius first um, at the beginning of the month. And then we used... I wonder if I can get this back together. Then we used Kitty Corn. Now, Kitty Corn is the cute, cutest little thing. It's... Uh, cross between kitty cats and unicorns. What's not to like? Um, but these but these are our kitty coins. And I use those uh, like the second week of the month. And then I was supposed to use body tarot for the last week of the month but as you are probably aware if you haven't been if you've been around my channel I have uh, not been here much this last week I have had um, I've been having a lot going on uh, in my private life uh, with family and so um, that just that just took precedence. But this is the body tarot. And I also need to say that I just, um, I tried to do a couple of readings in between here and there. But I just couldn't, I just wasn't feeling this deck. And I like this deck a lot. But it just wasn't speaking to me. And I am one who believes that I am spirit led. So if a, if a deck is, if I'm not connecting with it or if it's not speaking to me, I just can't use it. The oracle that I used is Inner Fucking Peace. And it gets a, I like the bluntness of it and I think it's funny, but some people are offended by it. And if you was offended, I apologize. But. That was the um, the oracle that I used, and it looks it looks like this on one side, and then it has something that corresponds with that on the other side, and so those um, that was the oracle that I used. For the month of August, it is um, still summer here. And I guess you're saying, what in the hell is she doing with thermal shirt on? My apartment, I freeze to death. As uh, long as I got on something long sleeve, I'm comfortable. Uh, it's almost 100 degrees today, so I'll be a little cool inside because I'm in and out a lot uh, with the dog. So, uh, there's that. So, for the month of August, it's still hot here. It's still summertime here. The kids will be going back to school at the end of the month, but it's still summer here. And so, um, I was blessed with some summer decks uh, for my birthday, which was in June. And I'm going to use those uh, for August. One is the version 1 of the summer holiday made by Dextiny. Uh, we're going to use it. Uh, well, Father, I'm dropping stuff. We're going to use it for one of the weeks uh, in uh, August. I like the little summer theme of this deck, but we're going to use it in August. 
And then uh, I'm thinking to uh, to break the monotony a little. Uh, I'm going to use the Tarot of Abyss. Uh, this deck has been calling to me. And I've been working with it a little bit behind the scenes. Uh, but I think it's time that I break it out um, for the feed. And I'm going to do that uh, the second week of August. And these are the backs. But it's a, a black and white deck. And like I said, this deck's been calling to me, and I've been working with it a little bit, but we're going to do a little more with that uh, this month. The third week of August, uh, I'm going to use Pastoral Tarot, and Pastoral Tarot looks like this. And this just exudes summer to me as much as the water in the beach scenes. Belle says hello. As you're aware, she has to find something to bark at every time I'm filming. Uh, so she's true to form. And the oracle... Um, that I'm going to use um, is a Kickstarter that came in in July and this is Love and Eleven Oracle by Mandy Peterson and um, I do see a lot of angel numbers and this deck just really excites me I can't wait to work with it I think the color of it um, and the images I've already laid it down with each of the decks that I plan to use in August and it looks like it's going to pair beautifully I also like the, the way that uh, it's a round deck but it has like four keywords going around it so However it lays, however it comes up uh, in the reading, then that's the, the keyword that you go with. And I think uh, and it's got a title, and then it has keywords around the side. So I think that's going to work beautiful. It's edged in a beautiful blue, and those are the backs. And like I said, I can't wait. Um, uh, let me show you some more of the cards. But yeah, these are, I think, just completely, completely lovely. And I'm real excited to work with these. So, that's what I have in store for the month of August. Um, let me know what you think. Um... What did you think of the decks that I used in the month of June? Uh, do you have any of those decks? Or are you using any of those decks in your practice? Um, let me know what you think of the decks that I've chosen for the month of July. Um, again, do you have any of those? How do you use those in your practice? You know, conversate with me. Let me know. Um, what you like, what you don't, what resonates. Um, make suggestions for the content you'd like to see me to create. Give me feedback on this video or uh, any of my others. Uh, I'd love to hear from you. If you have already subscribed to my channel, thank you. I'm grateful for your support. I'm hoping to grow and um, th that seems to be important to YouTube. Uh, if you would like my videos, that thumbs up also puts me higher in the algorithm. I would appreciate that as well. If you uh, haven't subscribed, uh, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you click on the little bell, it will notify you when I upload new videos. Um, 
share my videos with your friends. All of these things will help me to grow. And so um, I do, I, I am going to continue doing uh, my daily collective readings in between my other content. I do VR hashtags uh, to other creators' content. I also do um, the occasional unboxing and um, first impression flip through. I also do uh, a flip through and a deep dive review on decks that I've worked with for a little while. Um, and so I'm sure you'll be seeing me again here soon. And um, thanks for stopping by today. Bye.